thrilling finale to the first ever WRC Croatia. The top three drivers separated by only eight seconds going into the end of rally Wolf Power Stage. Overall victory and valuable bonus points on offer as usual. Pierre-Louis Lubet among the early runners through the 14km stage. The Corsican, no stranger to the asphalt, but still learning after a frustrating weekend. Similar story for the Irishman Craig Breen, a bright start to the rally, only to be compromised by a puncture on Saturday morning. Breen back in eighth, so in pursuit of bonus points in his Hyundai I-20, setting an early benchmark time, eight minutes and 17 seconds. M Sports Gus Greensmith going into the final day in sixth place, a positive weekend for the British driver, only to be hampered by hydraulic problems, causing transmission and brake issues, a lively run through the final few corners but making it through to the end. Another strong weekend for Toyota's Takamoto Katsuta, pushing hard, learning all the time, the hard work and commitments paying off. Two stage wins for the Japanese star, maintaining his run of top six finishes this season, quickest through so far. One of the stars of the weekend, French rookie Adrien Formeau, stepping up to make his full WRC debut with M Sport, showing more than a hint of his potential. Some impressive times, second fastest through two stages on his way to a top five finish on his debut. Formo, another one to watch. Next up, Oit Tanak, winner in the frozen forests of the Arctic last time out, but struggling from day one here. The wrong tyre choice, running well behind the top three over the weekend. So an all-out assault on bonus points here. Grip at a premium in places on the Croatian asphalt. The Estonian 2.4 seconds of teammate Green's time. Into the top three, all to race for. Thierry Neuville, who set the pace on the opening day, also compromised by the wrong tyre choice on Saturday, but just eight seconds behind rally leader Evans going into the power stage. The Belgian flat out, a touch too much. An overshoot near the end of the stage, costing precious time and off Breen's effort by just a second. Next, world champion Seb Ogier, dominant on Saturday. His Yaris bearing damage from an incident in the road section in the morning, relinquishing his overnight lead to teammate Evans. Pedal to the metal, a big moment for the champion too, but holding it together to power to the finish line. 8.14, fully three seconds quicker. So all eyes on this man, Elvin Evans, taking a lead of just 3.9 seconds into the final stage ahead of teammate Ogier down by it almost as much on the splits mid-stage, clawing it back towards the end. Then a huge moment at the very last corner. All eyes on the clock. 8.17.9, the time to beat Evans, losing out by just six temps, the second time he's lost a rally by less than a second. So victory and maximum bonus points for Sebastian Auger, who regains the lead in the title race. Four points for Craig Breen, Thierry Neuville, three, two for Evans, one for Oit Tanak. And with that, Ogier takes the lead in the Wolf Power stage standings with 11 points, two ahead of Toyota teammate Kala Rovampera. Then it's Craig Breen and Thierry Neuville on eight, Elvin Evans with five after the three opening rounds of the season.